What's up everybody, welcome back to another video and inside today's video I'm gonna be ranking every single one of these youtubers on this tier list from legendary all the way to bad I don't think there's gonna be any bad ones, but we're gonna see so I chose all the youtubers with over a thousand subscribers that post at least two um, ERLC videos um, a week if you do want to have access to this tier list then um, the link will be in the description down below Anyways, let's get started. So the first one is me over here. Um, I'm gonna be a bit humble and put myself in good. Um, next we have Aviator Phil, who posts a lot of cinematics and things. I do really like his content. And I think it's pretty original, so I'm gonna put him in good as well. Now we have Rising Wolf. I believe his role plays are extremely realistic, and I like how he uses VC for them. So he's gonna go in amazing. I also forgot to say that Aviator Phil has about 10,000 subscribers, and Rising Wolf has about 20,000. The next is real realistic mod he makes these kinds of you know rule um, moderator patrols i don't really really like it he has about 3,000 subscribers so i'm gonna put it in not bad next we have jake pro gaming um I would say that his role plays are probably not the best, um, so I'm also gonna put him in not bad. He also has about uh, 2,000 subscribers. Next, we have Mr. Cool Gaming with his role plays, which aren't bad at all. Um, he has about 2,000 subscribers as well, so let's put him right there. Remember that not bad does mean that they are actually not that bad. Um, the only actual bad, you know, tier over here is the last one. Next, we have Fraz Gaming. I don't really know him, so um. Uh, what do I do here? I, I wish there's something in between here because I have no idea what, what this guy does. Um, I'm okay. I'm I'm okay. Oh god, I don't want to put him. Back. Okay, you know. Okay, I'm, I'm just gonna put him there. Um, but I, I don't really know him that well. Okay, so <laughs> sorry, Fraz, if you're watching this, I don't really know what kind of content you post. You might be all the way up here. I have no idea, right? So, uh. Yeah, kind of an unfair rating there. But next we have Green Lamborghini. I believe he has about 8,000 subscribers. Um, I'm going to put him in not bad because I think he does have some pretty good content, but he's not very active. AJC Games um, as well goes in uh, not bad. Um, I think her streams are pretty good. Not too sure. She has about uh, 2,000 subscribers as well. Next we have um, King George Plays. I really, really like his role plays. Um, I really like, you know, the cinematics he does and everything with the CTSFO. So I'm going to put him in good. Game with Ishan goes in good as well. I really, really like his videos. Super, super original. Kind of like Amaze Plays videos. He has about uh, 1.8 thousand subscribers, something like that. Um, and yeah, King George Blaze has about uh, 3,000, I believe. Um, anyways, for Amaze Plays with 100,000 subscribers, 120,000, something like that, um, I'm going to put him in. Hmm, oh, God. Okay. Okay, so it's either legendary or amazing. It's between the two, but I'm gonna put him in amazing because he does not do role plays. But I think his content is extremely, extremely original. Plus, he posts like I don't know, like a, like a, at least five times a week, which is really, really impressive. Next, we have Officer John, who also goes in amazing. Sometimes his role plays are a bit slow paced, so you know sometimes I don't like that about him. But other than that, I think his content is pretty much perfect. Mix Sloth, um, I think I'm gonna have to put him in. In. Amazing as well. I really really like his role plays. Um, I, I you know I like how his role plays happen or I, I, I like his role plays, right? He I, I mean they make me laugh a lot. I mean I think Mick Sloth's role plays are the only role plays I actually watch out of all of these. Sometimes I'm gonna watch OMBs or uh, OMBs or Game and Goes, but other than that, I don't really watch any other role play videos. Next we have Locus, who also goes in. Oh, sorry, an amazing. Um, he has 1.6 million subscribers, um, and um, I mean, look. He's a good content creator, but his role plays aren't that realistic, and I think I would like him much, much more if he was actually involved in the community on Discord, because he's basically, like, I know he has a Discord account and everything, but, like, nobody knows who he is, and, like, he doesn't really communicate with, like, PRC or other people, or doesn't really do any community events or stuff. Maybe he should, maybe he should start doing that. I feel like he would be much more successful if he could, uh you know, talk to other people as well. Um, anyways, Game and Go goes in amazing. Um, I think Game and Go's content is pretty much perfect, uh, like with Officer John. 
Only thing is, m there's probably some role plays that are pretty unrealistic and some uh, parts that are, you know, maybe a bit more scrappy. But other than that, I think, um, you know, his ideas are very original, his thumbnails are good, and overall, a uh, amazing YouTuber. Next, we have Ruffles, who also goes in amazing. Um, he would have gone in legendary if he was more active and if uh, he was more involved with the community I mean he already is but if he was more active he would maybe be in legendary but uh, yeah with his 212,000 subscribers and game and go has uh, 30,000 now OMB is probably the only one that's gonna go in legendary because f throughout like four years or something he's been posting like five times a, a, a week I mean sometimes I can't even believe it okay sometimes I look in his Discord and there's like three YouTube shorts and one video posted in one day, which is extremely crazy. Definitely the best ERLC YouTuber by far. He has great role plays, great ERLC videos, great YouTube shorts, um, involved the community a lot. Remember, he did the event with Officer John in the PRC Discord. So, great, gar gr great guy overall, um, and plus he's super nice as well. So, police role play community is going to go in good. Um, right, so, okay, of course it's the official, you know, channel of, um, of PRC with, I, th I think about 120,000 subscribers, 130,000 subscribers, but I don't really think he's, th they're that good, like, they post, okay, like, update videos and stuff like that, but other than that, like, their content is kind of bad, or not bad, but like, not super, super interesting, I mean, kind of slow-paced, not edited the best or yeah but still though it's great if you want more information on the game um so yeah definitely a must watch channel of course if you want to you know, you know know more information about the game but other than that i don't think i really like the channel plus they don't even post that many videos anyways guys this is my tier list um if you do want to use this tier list once again then the uh link will be in the description down below of course i made this tier list so um, I tried to include the youtubers that I know there might be some that I do not know But I believe this is pretty much all of them that are actually active um, So um, yeah, that's that, that that's for this if you if you I mean if you, look if you disagree with me Then do make sure to tell me in the comments down below of course Maybe some of the ratings were a bit unfair such as Fraz or maybe Jake pro I'm I might have misplaced some right this is only my opinion some of you guys might like put him and I don't know legendary I have no idea but if you don't want to use this uh, tier list and do make sure to do it um, and if you do use it then um, you can tag me in the video and I would love to see um, how you guys place these youtubers but anyways guys thank you guys so much for watching get us to 2,000 subscribers and I'll see you guys in the next one